Hello so guys, today I'm going to show you how you can get a VPN on your Xbox One. Also, I'm going to tell you the pros and the cons too of having a VPN and a couple methods how you can get a VPN. So by the way guys, if you have problems during this video, you can just go ahead and join Aerofix on the Xbox One communities or clubs. So let's begin. So guys, the first method what you can try out is getting a VPN router. So what do you do? You get a VPN router that already has a VPN internet service built in. And this is going to be the easiest method, but a little bit expensive actually. But if you don't want to do this method, you can just skip a little bit forward so we can get on the other methods. And once you got that, you don't really need to set something up because it's already built in. And guys, I will leave some links in the description down below so you can just check it out if you want to. And let's go to the pros and the cons. So let's start off with the pros. The first pro that you are going to get and the best pro is not be able to get booted offline or getting DDoSed by somebody else. So sometimes people get mad in games and they decide to shut down your internet. They get your IP address and they find your location. They threaten you. They can't do that if you get a VPN. And this is a big pro actually. Now let's go to the second pro. So the second pro is going to be getting games so for co some countries you won't be able to access some games for example let's just say some countries don't have gta that you can download it so you can just change your location to wherever you want and download the game itself actually a lot of people do that on the nintendo switch they change their location to japan and they get a lot of japanese games that they can't get in europe so I heard that and actually people are doing it a lot. So let's go to the Dirt Pro and the Dirt Pro is getting games a lot earlier. So what do I mean with that? In Australia, for example, people get their games a lot earlier than the rest of the world. And how do they get that? It's like a 12 hour difference by them. So if they get like the new GTA, um, they will be able to play it 12 hours more early than the rest of the world and that's a big pro. Did you guys ever heard of the people that get swatted on live stream? Yes, you can actually save yourself by getting a VPN and people just swat you for no reason at all or they think it's just funny and you can just stop that by getting a VPN. Now let's go to the cons. I actually don't know a lot of cons on using a VPN. So the only con that I know is people can get a little bit of lag while using a VPN and that's just it. But for the rest you can just fix that by using a Ethernet or a LAN cable. Or if it's too far away you can get your router a bit closer by or your console closer by. So it's an easy fix for that. Now let's go to the second method how you can get a VPN. So guys the first thing you want to do is you want to search up login dynu. Now once you search that up you want to go on login user control panel. And by the way guys, if you please can like and subscribe, thank you so much. And now, after you make an account on this, you want to click on DDNS services. Once you did that guys, you want to go all the way to the right and click on add. So what you can do is you can click on option number one, if you want to create a new domain name. Or you can click on option number two, use your domain name. The difference is between these are if you click on domain name option two, it means that you already have a domain name that you can use. But on option one, you don't have a domain name and you're just creating one right now. And it's free to create actually. So you can also choose whatever you want. And I'm choosing this for example. So what you want to do now is you want to click on add. So guys, what we want to do right now is we want to turn all of these off. So 
turn this off, turn this off, and all of these. So, once you did that, you want to click on save. Now guys, like you see, we created our own domain name. And what we want to do right now is we want to go and open a new tab. But you want to remember our domain name. And also guys, if I don't show you anything on my screen, it means that I have some private information that I can't show you guys. And now let's go and enter express VPN login. So once you did that, you can just click on the first page and then you want to click on my account. Mine is a little bit different language, but it doesn't really matter. Now you want to fill in your information or you can just um, register at ExpressVPN. After logging in guys, you want to go to DNS settings and now this is the important part. Like I said guys, you want to remember the host name that you filled in, so you made like a new host name and like I said before, you want to remember it and once you fill it in, you want to do save host name. Now guys, you want to go back to the home page or my subscriptions and once you are in here, you want to click on setup express VPN. On here guys, once you are in here, you want to go to Xbox or whatever you want to use your VPN on. You can also even use it on the PlayStation 2. So now once you do that, you will get a special code that you need to fill in on your Xbox. Now let's go to our Xbox. So guys, once you are back on your Xbox One, what you want to do is press on the home button. On the home button you want to go to settings. On here you want to go to system and then you want to click on language and location. So once you did that you want to change everything on here to United States. So language as English, language region as English United States and location also as United States. And by the way guys, if you please can like and subscribe, thank you so much. And also let me know which method that you use. Like you see, now we've chosen United States. Let's go back and it will ask us to restart our console. So you just wanna restart your console. Once you restart your console back again, you want to go to home on here go to settings now you want to click on general on here go to network settings and go to advanced settings now you want to click on DNS settings and on here you want to click on manual now you guys want to remember the code that you used earlier like I showed you you want to remember this code and I'm gonna show right now on my screen which codes that you need to enter and it was like the last thing that I showed you before I uh, went to the Xbox one console back again on the second method so just enter that it could be like five five four uh, I'm just making something up on the primary DNS and then the secondary DNS, it could be something else too. So for everyone, it's going to be different. So it's not going to be the same. And this was it, guys. So let's go back. And once you tested it, what you want to do is you can go ahead and test your internet connection by going to network settings. And on network settings, you want to go to test network and speed to statistics. So, what we can do also guys, if you still have problems or questions, you can go ahead and join the Adderfix community right here and we'll help you around 
So like I said, if you have slow internet connection by using a VPN, you could fix it by connecting a LAN cable or Ethernet cable that I will leave a link in the description down below. Also guys, I will leave a link in the description down below the PS4 method, how you can do that. So thanks for watching guys, please like, subscribe and comment down below. Take care of yourself, goodbye.